Hi, Ricky here from AppChat. Today we're having a look at multitasking on iOS 9. And today we're having a look on the iPad Air 2. I did show it on my iPad Mini 3. But on the iPad Air 2, there is a slight difference with multitasking. You get an added feature. So first of all, let me just demonstrate multitasking again. So double tap the home button here. You can see I've got open applications. Let's jump into maps. So in the maps here, can see where I am if I slide along remember always from the right you've got all these applications that just sat there great I'm going to set a reminder here jump into reminders and I can add the reminders here that I might have to go to that location or I might have to do something else at a certain time so snapping back and then snapping back into them applications to get fluid movement again. Must admit it is a lot better on the iPad Air 2 compared to the iPad Mini 3. I know it's the same beta version, but different. It does seem to be running a lot better. You can get into all of these. You can do stopwatch and you see different locations I've been looking at. So, so we dismiss that. Let's jump into another application by double tapping that home button. We can jump backward and forward into applications. Jump into tech talk here my website make sure you go and check that out we've got information i haven't updated it sadly I must update it more often but please go and check that out so i can see here i've done some stuff with el capitan so i might want to write some notes about that or put in a date about it so we're going to click on calendar here and then the best thing is you can snap these two so these two now are live they're both operational and as you can see with two different fingers I can control the app so I can pinch and zoom and still move. So which is really good. I do love that feature there. And you can snap this all the way over to the other side and this then becomes your main application. You can't transfer it back. So please do be aware you have to re-go back here, find maps, and snap again to the middle. There we go. Again, works very simple, very quick, and very easy to use. So slide in. I'm going to jump into another application here. It might be a video I want to watch. So I've been watching Faulty Towers, another great BBC drama series there. Again, going back to the home screen, pinch to zoom, floats above the dock. Okay, so when you lock your iPad and come back, it is still there. I just wanted to try out that feature, so it's good to see. So landscape mode, it is there as well, and already orientated, so however you want to watch it. So that's great there, so we might want to jump back into Safari here. Dismiss this. I'm going to do is dismiss videos, but have Safari running in full. Click play, that will start there. Click to go full screen, and that will take us into full screen. And that was multitasking on iOS 9 on the iPad Air 2. Thanks always for watching. Please drop a thumbs up on the video, comment, rate, and subscribe. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye for now.